Phew. God damn it. Okay, so Elizabeth, what are you talking about? Looks like he doesn't give me the what job? Security guy? I don't care. Uh, clip increase, clip increase. I'm gonna go for the clip increase for the machine gun because... Oh wait, fire rate boost. Yes, please. There we go. Whew. Oh damn, we're actually very close to being out of ammo. Uh, being out of money. We should keep an eye on that. Okay, moving on. So I have no idea what Elizabeth just talked about. Not giving me the job, which means someone else got the job of security guy. A good walk, huh? Oh, wait. Well. I've never seen a lock like this. Huh? Anti-pressure device, a spring-loaded wiper, a relocker? Wow, well, that you sounds need a very... battering ram to open it. Battering ram, you say? A battering ram, you say? Hmm, I wonder if we can get our hands on a battering ram. Hmm. Well, there's definitely not gonna be one in here, but we can see if there's something that we can use in here. I don't believe a Chinaman like Chen Ling could. Okay, it's 2000 fucking 22. You can't fucking say a Chinaman, do you dude. Hear anything? Is Chinaman no offensive? Machines. I feel like it is, no right? Tools. It's gotta be. Let's go find that gunsmith. Look, our luck. Wow. It's a shrine. Yes. It's a figure of Comstock now. It is. It is not the Buddha, but Comstock. Although Comstock could technically be a Buddha, right? So let's not jump to conclusions here. Uh. Ghost Lin? Chen Ghost? Dude had a beard? I have no idea. Yeah, I don't feel like there's any reason talking to this guy, but whatever. Let's try it. Hello, sir. Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Excuse me, Chen Lin? Who are you? You speak up! Speak up! Can't hear you over all these machines! Very loud! Why is the skin so yellow? <laughs> I'm Booker DeWitt. Stand back! These machines very dangerous. Wait downstairs with Mrs. Lin. Uh, Daisy Fitzroy sent us. We need to talk to you about getting some weapons. Machines! Very dangerous! No place for stupid people! Want to lose pretty head? Mr. Lin... Downstairs! What is wrong with him? Remember him dead in that cell? Maybe in some way he remembers that too. How would you reconcile that? I don't know. You know what's very weird? Like, at this point, we know we can't return to the, our original reality, right? Elizabeth made that clear. So why are we even looking for Chen Lin anymore? Like, providing weapons to Daisy Fitzroy is basically useless by now because she doesn't remember us having the conversation we had. I mean, she probably does remember a version of us, but not the original version because the original version never came to her. It was another version. I, I feel like what I'm saying may be confusing, but stick with me here. So, if we went from... In the first reality, we call this... Reality 1, the original one. I talk to Daisy Fitzroy, Daisy Fitzroy sends me to get this guy to get us some weapons, right? Then we change the reality where this conversation may have never took place or has taken place in some other form. And so why would we give her Chen Lin or any weapons, right? If in this reality we never talk to each other. Weird. Hmm. Calm his troubled thoughts. Ease his burden. Bring Chen Lin back to me. But he upstairs. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm looking for Mrs. Lin. I'm uh, Mrs. Lin. No, I, I mean a little <laughs> Chinese lady. She was... Booker, this is Mrs. Lin. They took Chen's tools. What's he got without his tools? I don't know. My husband is Wife? a bit out of sorts. If he could work again, maybe if, if he could work, he'd. Mrs. Lin, can you tell me who? took your husband's tools? Goddamn police. They took them and locked them up in the impound in Shantytown. Why are we look even looking for the weapons at this point? Shh. No, we don't have to. What having his tools back? What? Why do we even want that? We're not getting any guns if Chen Lin doesn't have his tools. What? Let's head to Shantytown. That is so contrived. So we change our original reality, then we come here Dude's married to a different wife, but dudes are not really there, right? So now we have to give him his tools so he can manufacture us some weapons so we can give the weapons to Fitzroy so she can start a weird-ass revolution. What? And and not only that, no, we, we're not giving her the 
the weapons to start a revolution, but so she she can give us the airship, so we can get so we can get off of this place. That is the weirdest contrived plotline I've ever seen in a video game. Holy crap! What the fuck? <laughs> what the f what what? That is so weird. That's such an odd plot. Maybe I'm getting something wrong here, so I'm not gonna gonna hang on that. You know what? Yeah, sure. Go to Shanty Town or whatever. <laughs> So weird, though. So weird. Lynn had a bloody nose. I didn't notice. Seems to be in style. Hysteria. I'm not so sure it was a good idea. Oh, really? You, you don't think it was a good idea to switch realities and basically survive anyone that we have killed in a different reality where everything's different but also the same? Eh? That was probably the worst decision you could have made. Also, damn, there's a lot of police here, Elizabeth. God damn it. And I can't use the hooks, that's... Hey, wait, I can't use the hooks now. Whoop. Okay, that actually gives me a fighting chance here. Okay. I don't have that much money, so that I'm, I'm pretty worried about dying, actually. What's... Oh. What are you talking about? Oh, she can't throw them to me. Wait. She can? There we go. Appreciate it. That was a weird... Weird throw. What do you mean, out of there? I'm obviously on the roof, sucker. I'm a roof guy now! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Where I, oh wait, that is Shanty Town. Okay. Would you say you try to keep me comp stocked? That's the worst joke I can make. Okay. God damn it. Mm. Fuck. There was another one I didn't see. Yeah, this one. Fuck you. Where's the other one? There he is. Come on, baby. Ash. All right then. One more try. All the. Yeah. God damn it. That took me forever. So if there's another one, I can actually kill him with a. With a. How far can we jump? What? Wait. I wanted to jump on one, but I can't see any enemies anymore. Damn it. Let's just jump impossibly far. Whee! Bonk! <laughs> Wait, there were, were. There were enemies right below me. Stupid mofos. At least. At least, ladies and gentlemen, there is no Mr. Handyman. So, I guess I could be very thankful for that because I would have no ammunition to actually fight. So, yeah. That is great. No mistake. Lately, I've been hearing a whole mess of funny new ideas. Pay vacation. Fucking call me. Go ahead. I'm gonna take one of these. God damn! I like the enthusiasm of the guy, you know. Should make gameplay or something. Let's go in the shanty town, see what they have to offer for me. Uh, mm, 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 mm. Well, I don't have any money anyway. Wait a minute. I would love to have some ammunition though. There we go. So how much money do I actually need to get revived? I, I feel like 100 should be enough, right? Somehow the voice doesn't fit anymore. You know, the voice is a very clowny voice. Doesn't really fit here. Well, let's pull the lever. We are pulling a lot of levers in this game. Let me tell you, many levers have been pulled. Ask me. About what? My finger. Uh, huh? Sorry, I didn't. It's all right. Huh? It's as much a mystery to me as anyone else. I. Maybe Songbird knows, but he's not talking. Songbird. Otacon. Psycho Mantis. I get to wear this stylish thimble to cover up my hideous deformity. Hideous deformity, yo, you're just missing a bit of your finger. <laughs> hideous deformity. Great joke. We appreciate value. Wait, is that? No, that's not where I come from. Okay, okay, that's it. What is this? Okay, rocket launcher guy. Nice. You do immediately attack me if I go one step too far, won't ya? Won't ya? Stop 
Yeah, yeah, there we go. All right then. Okay, and I basically have no cover here, so that's gun animation, Elizabeth. Kill them. And now we just fight. Elizabeth. Hello. Oh, there you are. The rocket man is uh, insane. Uh, but I can't shoot the rocket man because then the ground troops will get me. I'm not criticizing you for anything, Elizabeth. I didn't even ask, okay? Damn. Alright, very nice. Elizabeth, you could provide me with some cover. That would be nice. Thank you. No. One, headshot two, headshot three, headshot four, five, headshot six, headshot seven, twenty more. Ah. <laughs> da, 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 da. Na, 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 na. There's another one. Bam. And another one bites the dust. Oh, figures. Nice. Okay. People are dead. Time to, you know, do other things. Hmm. We're still looking for tools, right? Yeah, for tools, so he, this guy... Oh, there's another gun automation. Hmm, there's another gun automation there. Two gun automations for... No! Oh my god, that was close. Two gun automations and also a cover and a fright hook just to kill these five enemies. Hmm, I wonder if there's a boss waiting for me somewhere around here. I would not be surprised if this was the case. Right, Elizabeth?